right? Right? It's off-road worthy right now. Yeah. Not to worry about the paint now. Maybe we solved the problem. Never so. purposely uh, sanded perfectly good paint before. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's okay. An easy promoter. Oh, you don't see. Good old Cummins key. Cummins key and uh, some rain. You guys ever try this stuff? I don't know, it's complete body fuel. It's probably terrible for you, but... It's a, uh, wow, orange dreamsicle. Oh, sounds like Rob's coming back. All right, gonna get some shoesies on. Um, what's up, dude? Oh, I know. I know where the drain plug is, I found that. Let's take a look. Here's the drain plug. Oh, look at this piece. Right here. The one way I was looking up so you can get a siphon. Yeah. You can siphon it that way, you can do it this, but this doesn't look like an air filter. No, that's your starter. Yeah. And then over here, I mean this is just, I mean this is for the fuel. It says it's a fuel filter. That's a fuel filter. Which I don't, I don't need to replace that. Um or couldn't I? Uh, it couldn't hurt, but as far as a uh, oil filter, no. These things are just what's in them is what's in them. Honestly, I wouldn't worry about it too much. Yeah. Hey, you just put 93 in it. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to be it's going to be fine. You're um yeah, you're gonna want to just undo that, and then it looks like there's a hole right here. If you lift up the rear end just a bit, it'll probably drain. It'll come right through the hole, and then just get a um, whatever pan or whatever the hell you want to put it in. Look at it. Is this oilless? Look at this thing. Uh, I believe so. But yeah, if that's really a serial number, if that's really the year 2001. You're not gonna get rust like this in a few years. Yeah. No, she's she's lived a good life. She's all right. No, she gone. She no, did. She gone. No, she gone. She just shut off on us. Thank God Roger had that little pancake. Yeah, that I little know, pancake one. It, when he brought it, I was like, yo, we don't, we got one. That and thing worked. Just in case, it's like, thank you. Yeah, for being that thing there. worked way better than uh, than this did, and it smelled better. Yeah. <laughs> it it smelled so bad. Too. I'll never get that smell out of my head. <laughs> that was terrible. Well, you know, the other good thing about that little pancake one was that, like, when we were out here, it was like 9, 10 o'clock at night. Yeah. It felt like it was a little bit quiet, but I was like looking around like, oh, shit. Oh, that poor thing. That thing is a tune-up. Yo, that thing looks fucking more than this. Yeah, it does. Good afternoon, guys. Welcome back to the channel. We got the, uh, oh, we got the Audi. The Audi. Look at it. It's all clean and stuff. So the Audi was dropped off to get detailed uh, last week. What day is it? I don't know. Last week, got dropped off to get detailed. Uh, just did a quick inside and outside. Nothing fancy. Just went over the interior. Got the headliner cleaned and whatnot. Just kind of shape her up because, um, well, like, uh, like I said quite a few videos ago, the Audi's finally going back up for sale. Time to get rid of this car. It's been a great car. But she's gonna go on the market and um, we're gonna see what we can get for her. We're gonna have a pretty big announcement coming soon to the channel, so um, stay tuned for that one. All right, she's all started up. Oh, uh, let's just drop that one and might as well, wait a second. Yeah, there we go. Might as well drop that one too. Cummins is covered in pollen. It had, uh, had cobwebs in her too. She's been sitting a while. She's been sitting over a week, so. Where's she at? This, this, yep, that does it, okay. Here we go. Uh-huh. Oh, that's much better. Oh, I got some drift in here too. That's nice. Notice how the windshield wipers are um, perfectly positioned for maximum window clearing this nice triangular spot of crap I can't see. Just uh, beautifully done, beautifully done, Cummins. Oil pressure's just through the roof. What a healthy Cummins. I just realized I haven't brought this in the wash before. I'm not sure if it's gonna fit. Gotta find that drive. Oh boy. 
Anyway, she's tight. She's tight. Yeah, 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 yeah. Woo! It's a loud. It's a loud coming. But I'm gonna be that guy that lets his truck run while getting a car wash. She hasn't ran in so long. So, we're gonna let her run while we wash her. Be right back. Okay, well, she's all cleaned up, you know, the best she can. I know, I know, it's like polishing a turd, but, uh, you know, that pollen, that pollen was looking really bad, so. Oh, you know what? I did. Every time I hop in this truck, I hear the whistling of, of the turbo. She brings a smile to my face. She's a whistling son of a gun, I tell you what. Got all the good noises coming out that tailpipe. I know you didn't click on the video to uh, to come and check out the comments, but I figure I'd just start her up, you know, see how she's doing, wake her up a little bit. Don't worry, this thing is gonna get what it needs to get. Okay, we're gonna go through her. She has a ton of work and I have just had uh, no excuse, no excuse, but I've, I've literally had just no time to do it. Uh, we'll get to her. When we get to her, just be patient, okay? I know you guys want to see action with this, and, you know, the past quite a few videos have been on the comments because I was excited to get it. And, uh, you know, it's a cheap truck. It's it's just a cheap truck that, uh, like I said in the previous video, I take, uh, I take crap, and um, I just kind of do some things to make it less crap, and uh, if I can make it so this Cummins lasts just a little bit longer, on the road and um, make her healthy again. You know, it's what, it's my duty. It's my duty as a small YouTuber of a car channel to um, take these pieces of crap and uh, do small things to make them less crap and um, go from there. Anyways, onward with the, uh, with the rest of the video, shall we? See how that Jeep's doing. Sun goes down a little bit. A little bit cooler. Oh god. Okay. It's gonna it's gonna hurt you more than it hurts <laughs> the teeth. Just gonna keep telling myself that yeah that's great, huh? <sighs> what grid is that? That's 150. Oh my god, okay. Let me know when you're ready. Uh, let me get some sun on it. We're ready. Um Oh it's ruined, look, it's okay. <laughs> oh. Okay, can I see them? Oh boy, all right. Just go for it. Go for it? Yeah. Oh, oh no. Oh, dude. <laughs> okay. That's it, we're done for the day. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God. Part of it's got to feel satisfying though. Oh yeah. That is a lot of paint coming off of that. <laughs> that is a lot of paint. You wanted a green piece, right? It's working. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. It's definitely working. Great. 150. Oh. Go, right? Right? It's off-road worthy right now. Yeah. Not to worry about the paint now. Then we solved the problem. <laughs> and that's <laughs> right. Can't get any worse than this. Can't get any worse than this. That makes short work. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. That will. Uh, that won't be too long. We'll have to do some hand work around the uh, yeah, a frame okay. and whatnot. But Good. other than that, I mean the hood, just right. Super quick. <sighs> oh boy, dude. One door down. This is a first for me. Yeah. Never Same. purposely. Uh, Sanded perfectly good paint before. <laughs> I mean, I've f***ed up some paint before. Yeah, yeah right? <laughs> yeah. It's just a rust bucket waiting to happen, so. 
Yeah, that is true. The quicker you get this stuff on and yeah. undercoat it and prevent all the uh, New England uh, wear and tear. Yeah, what does it feel like? There's, there's no shine in that. Oh, dude, that feels nice. I think I, think I got the clear coat. What do you think? Oh, I took it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'd say so. Oh. <laughs> clear coat, maybe some of the... Whew, a couple of levels. Yeah, yeah right? You can buff that out. Yeah, she'll buff out. <laughs> well, that's okay. An easy promoter. You stay on it a while, it, it will come off. You had, uh, I don't know what you had over here. What's that? Oh, yeah, the Wrangler. Yeah, the Wrangler? Yeah. yeah, that came off. Oh, nice. So it's just up to you if you want to stick with it. Oh, man. Oh, you go for it, dude. All right. Ryan. Uh, <laughs> 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 oh, yeah. There we go. Oh, good. In the bug in it. Oh, <laughs> Nat, right there. Of course. Here are Rob's here to save me. Don't worry. Yay. You should have just left it at the moment. Yeah. Oh, extra uh, texture. Yeah. Oh, oh, you know what? Yeah, it's thorough. It is. <laughs> Whatever. So. It doesn't need to be uh, flat. Oh, it's Tough work, but it pays the bills and for beer. Look at that. Wow, look at the cap. So we're just going to put a clear coat on it and call it a day, right? Yeah, this is it. This is it. That's a really fine looking wrap. I like it. guys do you have the color for this did it say what's that did it say the color for this uh anvil is what it's called anvil anvil yeah anvil so it's gonna have a bluish yeah. in the sunlight yep cool man so, like yeah the, one of the guys that's on a story when he was looking at two different jeeps from different lots yeah and he was saying that uh, i think it's uh, overclocked uh was saying that on his channel that when he was looking at the jeep that he ended up just selling recently yeah and, uh, another jeep he thought they were two different colors. One was like a gray, and then one was sort of like a blue. And it turns out that uh, they were both the same color. They were both anvil. Just the light was different, so yep. it looked a little different. But yep. So it kind of depending on where the light's hitting it, it yeah. it'll look either like kind of like a gunship gray, or it'll, it'll have that nice blue. Awesome. 
No, it came out pretty well. Oh, dude, it's so good. Open that streak, yeah, that should, that should yeah, all dry. Oh, that'll yeah. flash off. Yep. Yeah. Well, the rest of it, I know it was dark. This took, uh... <laughs> <laughs> this took quite a while. This I took... can't believe we got it done in one day. Uh, I can't believe we got it done in one day. So I say give it the night. I'm, you know, unfortunately, we gotta, we'll leave it outside, but it should be clear. And then uh, tomorrow in the sunlight, any imperfections, you always got, I actually have some, some more in um, there. It'll probably just a little bit. Yeah, you're right, <laughs> with the hardener. But we got plenty extra, so I think we've got right. like four, another, uh, four other cases of the tentacle, so. Yep, yep, we got plenty. Plenty that. Oh, it's really good. good. Cool. Oh, this is so good, thank you so much, man. Yeah, no problem. Dream come true. I'm glad it came out all right. Hopefully, once we pull all the stuff off, you know. Uh, so good. I mean, we did a we did a fairly decent job at wrapping this thing, so. Yeah, I think so. I, I think it should uh, unwrap just fine. So. Cool. Uh, 